Hey, welcome back, folks. It's 1224 on this Thursday afternoon. We had a chilly start to the day and partly cloudy start, but that's about to change. Check out the wind flow. We have a southeasterly wind, and that's allowing for a lot more cloud cover to come into our area. A check a closer look to home. We'll definitely see these clouds start to roll in, and these clouds will just continue to keep rolling in. And we're pretty cool right now, and we're going to stay pretty mild for the rest of the day. 73 in Rio Grande City. 72 in McAllen and Edinburgh, 69 in Westlake, Raymondville and Harlingen, 70 in Port Isabel and 71 in Brownsville. And we keep these temperatures for the rest of the day. I mean, temperatures hold pretty steady. By 3 o'clock, we're hitting around 75. It'll be mostly cloudy. It'll be a mild day, and we're not going to be breezy at all. If you've stepped outside today, there's no breeze. There's really no wind. By 6 p.m., 71 degrees, and then by 9, mostly cloudy skies, 67 degrees. So, your future track, this is the European model. This is what's going on. This high pressure system right here is going to shift to the east and that sets up for one, more cloud cover, two, for another cold front to come sweep through the valley. Sunday, 11 a.m., that cold front should have already cleared the valley. It's allowing for more cloud cover and you know the drill. A cold front comes through and those showers start to spark up until another high pressure system starts to set in. You can see that here with all this clear area next to the Dallas-Fort Worth area, the Louisiana, Mississippi, Georgia area there. Your rain chances for the next three days, well, it's dry today, and then tomorrow, 20% chance of spotty showers, and then we dry out on Saturday until more rain chances come in on Sunday. Well, on the water, your winds are out of the east at 10 to 15 miles per hour. Your bay water is at a moderate chop. There are no advisories right now. Your next tide is a low tide at 221 tomorrow morning. So we're done with tides for the day. And your seas are at 2 to 5 feet. So today, high of around 75. It'll be mostly cloudy, a mild afternoon. Winds are right now shifting from the northeast to the southeast. We saw that on the map at 5 to 15 miles per hour. And then cooling down to 67, mostly cloudy and cool. Southeasterly winds at 5 to 10 miles per hour. So if you're headed out, you might want to grab a jacket. It's not going to be terribly cool, but we are definitely going to cool off. We'll enjoy the temperatures today because we go on a little bit of a heating trend. Check out Saturday, high of around 90 degrees, low of around 69. And then on Sunday, hand in hand with having to spring our clocks forward one hour, we're also expecting another cold front. We saw that on the European model on our future track. And then Monday, pretty cool day. High of 64, low of 55. And then we start heating back up. But Tuesday and Wednesday, and I want to talk about those a little bit because they look like they're going to be amazing days as far as the weather is concerned. High of 68 on Tuesday. High of 70 on Wednesday, low of 48 on Tuesday, so it's going to be a little bit of a chilly start. We're going to continue tracking that next front for you, and that's your first Warren 5 forecast.